Next stop for the WRC, Estonia. Happy hunting ground for two crews in particular. Wojtanek following the script to perfection two years ago, winning his home event, then favourite to repeat the feat last year, only to be usurped by a young Finn. Estonia 2021, scene of Calais Rovenpera's first top flight victory. So adding another record to his name, the youngest WRC rally winner at just 20 years and 289 days. It was a nice weekend. Of course, we, we really enjoyed it. Um, there was some pressure before it. We had a series of really bad results uh, with technical issues and my own mistakes and, and everything. So it was not easy summer until that. Uh, and yeah, then we went there. I knew that this is an event where I can win for sure. We had a good fight in the beginning. Then, uh, then Oit, who was the favorite also there, had some issues and, and mistakes. We kept going and, and then did a big push on Saturday and, and we're ready to win. A big push in the shape of a stunning run through Saturday's opening stage. Robin Pera, 10 seconds quicker than the rest to more than double his advantage as rally leader. A first top flight win in his sights. There would be no denying the young Finn, claiming victory by almost a minute. So joining Dad Harry as a WRC winner. A memorable day for the family, Robin Pera Sr. struggling to hold back the tears. <laughs> yeah, it's quite normal for him actually, always when something big like that happens, he's, uh, he's emotional. But, uh, but yeah, I think uh, it was even bigger thing for him than, than for me, um, because I knew that, uh, that yeah, we can win a rally when the time is right and, and we can do it. Um, of course, we wanted to prove it to ourselves also, because always when, when you don't have to win, you, you are not really sure how to make it, how, how you can make it, yeah. So for him it was a big thing. Of course my mom was there also and, and it was nice to, to see them first thing when coming out of the car. To say Robin Pera hasn't looked back would be an understatement. Winner of four of this season's six rounds. Runaway leader at the top of the championship. And ominously for the rest of the field, two of his potentially strongest events next. Back home in Finland after the return to Estonia. Catch me if you can. Rally Estonia is normally a really enjoyable event, at least for me. It's really fast, really flowy. Um, the roads are quite sandy, so the grip is, is pretty good. You have some small lines and ruts always, so you can push quite hard on the, on the high-speed roads. You need to really be comfortable in the car, comfortable to push, because even if you drive clean and, uh, and good stages, it's not enough really. Yeah, you can always go faster by pushing and pushing the car harder, so it's quite important to have a good confidence and push hard. Kalarov and Pera very much the man to beat as he returns to the scene of his first top flight triumph on Estonia's ultra-fast stages. WRC Plus, all live.